All right, I just want to point out a uh, design flaw here because uh, a lot of people or people like my wife get on this or something, they can never figure out what's going on. So the, the H180 doesn't have the self-leveling bucket, but the way they have the geometry all set up here, so see, they, this is like the main, oh, I'm not too close here. This is the main support here and everything. And this bar right here is basically just to come up to this little cradle here and then keep the bucket. Basically, it keeps the geometry all pretty close. So when you're loading or when you're lifting, um, the bucket does stay relatively level within a couple degrees of, of where it was when you started lift, picking it up. But one problem I found though, so when you roll, uh, so on the front of this bucket, I've added these chain hooks on it just for lifting things around the house. So if you have the chain hanging like this, uh, you know, just so it's clear in the bucket or even more so, so the bucket's tilted up back further, um, all this geometry starts to pinch up a little bit. Okay, so as it gets to a certain point, this thing rocks far enough forward here in the front by the bucket, and it actually binds. So the further up you go, the harder it gets, and you have to release or tilt the bucket forward a little bit, and then it'll go up a, you know, a couple inches more, tilt the bucket forward, go up a couple inches more. So first my wife got on it, got stuck, she thought she broke something. It was all jammed up, you know, maybe not jammed up, but it just wouldn't go any higher until you tilt the bucket forward. So uh, I want to show you that. Hopefully I could... Uh, tape this in and show you at the same time. I'm going to jump in the cab and uh, see if it works. Alright, hopefully this is good enough here. Okay, so I'm going to roll the bucket all the way forward and start coming up. And there you go, it's stuck right there already. You can see how it's binding up. If I roll the bucket forward some though, you know, it keeps coming up. Um, so, let me tilt the bucket all the way parallel here to the ground. Oh man, I'm in the shade right there. Oh, you guys probably can't see that very well. But as I'm lifting here, oh, I'll tell you what, let me jump out on the side. Okay, so see the angle right now? I have it pretty, pretty parallel to the ground. And uh, I'm gonna bring it up. So, okay, so it's still pretty parallel. I'd say maybe it's uh, lifted the front of the bucket up. Uh, I don't know, maybe one or two degrees at the very, very most. And then uh, keep going up. It's still, I'd say maybe only two degrees out from the ground. Um, so, when it's in the normal loaded or a not normal but when you're in a level position the geometry all tracks really well it's only when the bucket is rolled completely forward um that it has a problem so see this thing's up really high right now that's as far as i could roll it come down with it now look at how much more movement i have in it so like i said somebody uh measured something a little bit off when they designed all this i think um but just something to know when you're using it, it's, it's not a problem. I don't ever have an issue with it because I know it happens. So I just kind of roll the bucket as it goes. But don't panic if you do have that happen. Um, like I said, it's just a, something in the design. All right, guys. Well, like I said, if you ever got any questions, let me know.